The Embraer E2 family are a set of medium-range planes developed by the Brazilian company Embraer. Now the company already saw a huge amount of success from the original E-Jet family, but it was time to take it up to the next level. The program was officially launched at the Paris Air Show in 2013 and they gained a total of 274 orders. But the most current and the recent E2 jet, the E195E2, is a significant piece of engineering. On March 7, 2017, Embraer rolled out the largest aircraft of the second generation of the E2 family. It's considered the most efficient aircraft in the single aisle jet market, with the plane expected to enter into service in the first half of 2019. Now, the E195 has been extended by three seat rows and will accommodate up to 146 seats. In February 2016, Embraer announced that they decided to increase its wingspan by 1.4 meters for greater lift, along with a maximum takeoff increase of 2 tons to extend its range by 450 nautical miles. In total, the plane has a range of 2,450 miles and is set to compete against the Airbus A22300. Now, the aircraft has a dedicated wing, which allows the plane to increase its fuel efficiency. The design of the plane came from rigorous testing and R&D development, which has allowed the plane to become streamlined. This will allow the plane to carry 10% more passengers than the A220 and still have the same weight. Now, Embraer will currently be using two test planes for their certification campaign. The first prototype will be used for aerodynamic and performance tests, while the second prototype, which will also make its inaugural flight by the end of this year, will be used for validation of maintenance tasks and the interior. Regarding the operating cost, the plane is apparently more efficient than the likes of the Airbus A320neo and the Bombardier CS100 and the 300. The E190E1 is currently 18% more costly per seat than the current A320, but it has a cost of 23% less per trip. The plane is 20% more efficient per trip than the A320neo, but it has no difference in cost per seat compared to the A320neo. However, it should be noted that the E2 family competes head-to-head -head with the A390neo in the European market, whereas in the US it's more efficient. Comparing the E2 family to the A220, the E2 is 1% less efficient per seat and 7% cheaper per trip. Since the launch of the program, the E2 has reached 690 commitments. 275 of which are firm orders and 415 are options and purchase rights from both airline customers and leasing companies. Currently, the E-Jets are operating with about 70 customers in 50 countries, being a global leader in the segment of aircraft with up to 130 seats with over 50% market share. So there you go captains, that was a brief look at the E195 E2. If you have any further information to add then share it with us in the comments below. Remember to like and subscribe for more aviation news videos and I'll see you guys in the next one.